Astigmatism typically creates a blurriness um, if it's uncorrected for both the distance and near objects. The more severe the astigmatism, the more out of focus or blurry are objects. Astigmatism can be related to several different curves within the eye. The cornea, the clear windshield of the eye, is the most important and the most relevant uh, that is involved as far as the, the amount of astigmatism. When we do cataract surgery, there is an astigmatism relating to the lens inside the eye, the natural lens. But of course, we're taking out that cloudy lens and replacing it with a new lens. So the amount of astigmatism that was in the natural lens is no longer relevant. The main astigmatism we need to deal with is on the surface of the eye, on the cornea. To elaborate more on limbal relaxing incisions, these are um, incisions that have been traditionally done for many years by cataract surgeons and we call it rec refractive cataract surgery. In the past, these incisions were made by hand using diamond blades and there are certain nomograms or charts that we use to try to estimate how much, how long the incisions are, how deep, where is the placement relating to the severity of the astigmatism and also factors such as the age of the patient and the health of the eye. Unfortunately, um, by hand, it's very difficult to get exactly how long, how many degrees, how much depth that the uh, diamond blades are able to go versus our newest technology, which is a femtosecond laser. Femtosecond laser is so much more accurate than anything we've been able to do by hand for, uh, for the last 30, uh, 30 years. This laser can actually create the incisions exactly where you want in microns, which is a very precise measurement. And it also allows us, as far as our nomograms, to really fine tune and dial in how much astigmatism correction is necessary to reduce the blur that you have from astigmatism. So this has really revolutionized our ability to address astigmatism during cataract surgery. Thank you for joining us on this video and we look forward to seeing you next time.